Uh, hey guys, before you go on, there's just something I really wanted to explicitly explain um, about this. It's kind of like a little bit of a, just a difference in behavior between the PC and iOS and Android uh, that I've been playing around with. This is a little bit of a spoiler because in the next uh, episode, you're going to see how to make a skybox uh, with that'll that'll clear with a an alpha channel, which means usually like usually when you you know clear the screen before the next frame, you'll actually clear the entire screen. Whereas what we're going to do in the next video is actually set a lot of that screen to a transparent color, which means that the camera image that had already been set in the last frame will still hang around. And so, for example, when you're demonstrating it, that black area you're seeing at the moment in this doorway, that's going to be like the camera image. And at the moment, there's nothing being rendered on top. So you're getting this kind of glitchy effect. And I just wanted to demonstrate something here, right? So that's for the PC that that's the platform that that's you're seeing that on, right? On the PC, Mac and, and Linux platform. And then, of course, I can I can switch to iOS, which is what this next uh, this next Skybox uh, tutorial, what that was kind of like built for. It's for testing this on the iOS. And I just want to take a minute to like, you know, just really show, okay, yeah, so do it on the iOS. It, 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 it behaves in the, like exactly the same way. So yeah, it's, it's allowing us to, to use a cameras, uh, to clear a camera with, with an alpha channel, with a transparency. But then if we go over to Android, you might be, you might be getting a bit of a hunch about where I'm going with this. I'll move the camera around and we're not getting that effect anymore. It's totally cool. There's, there is a workaround and there's another video, uh, two videos later where I show how to make a skybox for Android. And that technique would also work on, on, uh, on an iOS. In fact, it would probably be, it's a bit more of a standard way of doing things to, yeah, to clear a, to clear a camera with, with a alpha channel. I, I admit that's kind of a strange solution. It was just like something that I kind of stumbled across. Anyway, I'll, I'll leave the video up, up, up to you. If you want a really concrete one, go to chapter, oh, the, the one that's called AR Skybox, uh, AR Core Skybox. And if you're kind of curious about how to do it, uh, this, this, uh, glitchy way, you can watch the next AR Kit Skybox. Awesome. Oh, you know what? Actually, no, one more thing I wanted to mention. Uh, uh, a friend of mine, Carl, has just sent me an email about this new thing that Unity's released where they're, um, uh, it's called like AR interface, I think, where they're kind of merging, merging AR core and AR kit into the same, uh, the same API in a sense. So, so I'm hopefully going to have a video of how they're getting it done and, and put one of those up soon as well.